Okay, let's create a DFA to accept our language of strings chosen from the alphabet of A's and B's that end in AA. A good way to start is by creating a little sub part of the machine that will accept the suffix. So I'm going to create a little part here or a pathway that will lead to acceptance if I see the AA. Oops, that's got to be the initial, not the final. This is the final. There we go. Now the question remains is how do we get into the rest of the, the string, stuff that's not the suffix. So if I'm just reading a bunch of B's, I haven't yet started on my suffix, so I'll stay here. If I've read one A and I read a B, I sort of reset my state that I still need to see two more to have a string that ends in two A's. Likewise, if I see two A's and then read a B, I need to reset the suffix state so that I go back to waiting for another AA to show up. But if I read AA and still see more A's, then I stay in the final state. Okay, so let's see how this might work on a couple simple inputs. This string is not in the language because it doesn't end in AA. The first move takes me to Q1, which is halfway to a suffix, but then the B takes me back to a uh, the reset state. Read two more Bs, stay there. 1A takes me halfway to the suffix, but it's not quite there, so when I run out of input, this string is rejected. If I run it for a string that's in the language, starts out the same, I get reset back to the initial state, but then I read my suffix and the string is accepted. 